Ben, you're going to have a chat, buddy. I'm getting you saved, dog. Are you okay with that? So, Spud, I've had a busy day. I've been to the South Australian border and I've brought someone back for you to meet. Everybody, I'd like you to meet Pepper. stick will do just fine. The dog doesn't care if you're rich or poor, clever or dull, smart or dumb. <laughs> hey Pip, first our class, pay attention. Hope you've got your writing materials ready to go. You got that? If you ever want to see a dog get real bummed out, get a pup that's never seen rain before. It's like the worst day ever, isn't it Pip? Poor bugger. When you're spending every day on your own And here it goes Just a kid You got a friend in me So for all those that wanted it, here's a pip update. She's going good. She's getting bigger and bigger every day. And she's cunning as cunning. Very smart little girl. Spud is starting to, well, he's starting to get over it and starting to accept that Pip's here to stay for now. If you live that long, isn't that right, dog? What it's really like spending all day with a puppet the back. She collects everything she can find in the cabin. Sometimes you wonder where the hell it even was. And you come today with a piranha chewing on your finger. It's adorable. I train dogs. A lot of it's monkey see, monkey do. Hip sit. Good girl. I need to have a chat. You don't seem real happy since Pip showed up. Do you like Pip? So, you wanted to leave. Well, that's a bit rough, mate. Paying attention? Spud! Show what to do. Good job. Fetch him up! Fetch him up! Up. Good job. Good girl. Good girl. Someone was horrified the other day when I said if Pip lives that long. This is what I mean by if she lives that long. Come here, Tiny Dancer. They will eat you alive. Good girl. Come here. We need to have a chat. Yesterday, when I dropped you off at Mum's, you ate her sprinkler. Now, you're not going to be popular here today, so you better behave yourself. Faye will hand you an ass whooping if you eat her sprinkler again. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got a new addition to the team here at Blue Hills. Um, after Pip arrived, a few people loved her so much that they decided that they wanted to get their own. So here's Ruby. Play this in addition. A uh, quick little pip update while I'm going. Here, pip. Get up. She gets in all by herself now. Like a big dog. There you go. Cute little puppies. Cute little puppies. Cute little puppies. At least you're keen to go back to work. So 
Today we're learning a very valuable lesson, aren't we, Pip? Don't mess with Patrick. I don't know what I've been told. Spotty's fat and growing old. Pip. Pip. What are you doing? What are you doing? Wake up! Come on, we got work to do. There's weevils over there, Pip, and they need mastery. Come on. You're not going to do it for me, are you? Nope. Let's play a game of Can You See the Dog? Is the dog behind the seat? No. Is the dog on the seat? No. Pip! What are you doing down there? Come on. Yeah, chop. Yeah, I know, mate. The struggle's real today. It's too hot for this business, isn't it, Snickerdoo? Oh, dear. Today's update is still cleaning grain. We've changed farms. We are still on the looping program. Um, yeah, but not real happy. You can't walk home and sleep on the lawn today because we're not at home, so. Yeah, and Pip's just loving eating shit because that's what Pip does. Isn't it, Pip? Stop eating things and you don't know what they are. Pip's huge. Patrick's still a dead girl, aren't you, Patrick? Get him, Pip. Get him. Get him up. Get hold of him. Get hold of him. Get hold of him. Come on, Bubble and Speck, get in there. So we almost had a major industrial accident last night. Um, working on a trailer in the workshop and uh, I had a cutoff wheel on the grinder and I went to put the cutoff wheel, well, the grinder down while the disc was still spinning. Unbeknown to me, someone had fallen asleep in the dark right next to me. Black dog in the dark, not easy to see. She was very, very lucky. You can see there where the disc went down the top of her head. Longest minute of my life catching her after she ran off from that. Come on. I don't know, Spud. I just don't know. This new apprentice sheep dog is no good. What do you reckon? Thoughts? Don't scream. Don't scream. Don't scream. Yep, you're doing a really good job. But for the love of God, Patrick, you're not a sheep dog! Push him up. Push him up. Push him up. Push him up, Pip. Push him up. Push him up. Said no. You cannot chase them. I don't care how much you think they need to be rounded up, Pip. You're not chasing them. Oh, the days are getting long. And uh, there's a few sheep around up here in the moment. Somebody is a little excited, you might say. What do you reckon, Pip? You gonna get him? You ready? You gonna get him? Get him, Pip. Get him. I dropped the kids off halfway down the block for a run. And they're finally catching up. Come on, Beavis and Butthead! Come on, quick! There's Pip. There's Spud. 
Hey, Spud. <laughs> hey, Pip. How you going? What'd you do with the old spotty dog? Where'd you go? Yeah. Oh, Pip, you're a worry. Dog that's never seen a morning dew before. Running around licking the grass trying to get a drink off it. <laughs> it's got to be one of the funniest things I've seen for a while. Come here. Say good morning to everyone. <laughs> Pip says good morning, everybody. Check this out. Get up. Get up. Come on. Good girl. Clever girl.